it wasn't good. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a little bit different of a video. I'm going to be reviewing BTS's coffee drinks. If you guys didn't know, they have a collaboration with a company that I do not know the name of, but I'll leave the name up somewhere here. So they have two types of coffee drinks and you can get the faces of each members on the drinks. They have a cold brew version and then the hot brew vanilla latte version. I've already tried the cold brew version a long long time ago which is why I never did this video. I was not a fan but I've never tried the hot brew vanilla latte version so in today's video what we're going to do is I'm going to try to make this cold brew Americano actually good and I'm gonna try to use it with this we're gonna give it another try maybe it'll be better I don't know but I'm also gonna try the hot brew version it doesn't give me any instructions so in each one of these little drinks you can get your favorite member all seven members they don't have like one that's specifically OT7 each drink has one specific member i picked up three because you go you know your girl doesn't have money to get all seven these are kind of expensive they're like three dollars 2.95 each so i got three specifically i don't want to get all seven just because what if i don't like it but i love the fact that they are reusable so after you drink them you can just literally clean it out and then have these be on like a storage or like a little shelf if you want to keep them so for the hot brew version, there's literally no instructions. It doesn't tell me if I can microwave this or not. I don't want to put this in the microwave right now. So I'm going to drink it warm. It's just kind of been sitting outside chilling. So I'm going to drink it warm and then also put it in ice and see if I like it as a better like an ice vanilla latte. And then the cold brew, we're going to drink it cold, obviously. So first, let's start off with the cold brew. And mind you guys, I love coffee. Like I'm a very avid coffee drinker. I drink coffee pretty much every single day and... I did not like this cold brew. I love like cold brew. I have some Americanos from Starbucks. I love making my own cold brew. I love coffee, but this was very bitter, but not in like, oh my gosh, I love it. It's so good the way. It's like, <laughs> it wasn't good. So again, I got Jimin. We're gonna open this baby up. Please don't spill. Okay, so there's no like seal or anything. You can literally just pour it in. So that's what I'm going to do. We're going to give it a little swirl, a little taste test. Wait, it's not that bad. Why was the, the first time I got this? It was nasty. I did not like this. Maybe I just got a bad batch, but this isn't bad. I'm going to put the whole thing in. I like it. I would drink this whole thing. It just tastes like your standard cold brew. Now, to kind of make it a little bit better, I'm going to add in this this is the skinny syrup and it's just vanilla syrup you can buy starbucks vanilla syrup i got mine my skinny syrup from tj maxx but i know you can also order this baby on amazon i would highly suggest it if you like making your own coffee at home it just gives it a really sweet vanilla flavor not too much i don't like my coffee too sweet let's try this again i'm excited i love the fact that i love this now because i might actually get it more and when i see it Not bad. Kind of prefer it without this syrup, which is weird because I usually love this syrup with everything. But not bad, not bad. Kind of good. Okay, so then we're going to try Hobie. Yeah, this is Hobie. We're going to try Hobie's, and this is the hot brew vanilla latte. I'm not going to add this vanilla syrup in it because it already has vanilla. We're going to take one sip. If I can open it, we're going to take one sip without putting it in here. I'm expecting this to taste like, you know, like a Starbucks, like those Starbucks frappuccinos. I expect that quality of taste. It's really not that bad at all. I actually really like this a lot more than the cold brew. Actually, I prefer both. They're actually both really good. This straight up just tastes like a little bit less sweet of the Starbucks frappuccinos. It's very good. I would strongly recommend. I forgot to mention, but you guys definitely can just get these at your local Korean supermarket. Like H Mart, Zion, like any local Korean market should have these. All my local Korean markets had these in the beginning, but they ran, they ran out. So I picked these up from a Japanese market. So basically any Asian store should have them. We're going to try this with it being iced and cold i hope it's good because then it kind of tastes like it reminds me a lot of like the starbucks just vanilla lattes honestly 
I like it. I like it a lot. Wow, I would actually, I'm gonna put these in the fridge. I like these. These are good. Recommend, would recommend $2.95. What, that's like the same size as like a Starbucks drink and you get a cute little BTS member with it. So I do like that. Let me see the sugar. There's a crap ton of sugar in this. <laughs> Here's the ultimate test. If you guys don't know what these are, these are basically sweet rice cakes. They're called dongos, I believe. And they're just little rice cake balls. And I really like to eat these with coffee. So we'll really know the test if these two pair well with this. Basically, it's like a very spongy, not spongy, but like sticky type of texture. It's like the same texture almost as just normal rice cakes, except these are like a dessert, while normal rice cakes are more of like a meal. I taste like mochi. Have you guys ever had mochi before? I'm going to try it with the cold brew. I feel like the original cold brew without the vanilla syrup would have paired really well with the sweet rice cake because it's a little bit more bitter paired with something sweet be really good but with the vanilla syrup it's very very sweet so it's like a little bit overpowering also you guys are wondering all the flavors in these dongos are the same round two we're gonna try it with the vanilla latte with the dongo I like this a lot. I feel like I would even like the dongo with the vanilla latte being hot. I thought like that would be even taste even better. Honestly, you guys, I'm very impressed that I like these. Um, especially the cold brew one I've had before and I was not a fan. So I think I just got a bad batch. But 10 out of 10, recommend these. They're like $2.95 and you can pick your favorite member, wash it afterwards. You can get a free little merch item afterwards. Would strongly, strongly recommend. And if you've tried these before, leave a comment down below letting me know if you like them or not. And let me know if you guys want more videos like this. I love to do, like, celebrity endorsement videos where, like, they endorse a product and I try it out. But I also need to know if you guys like these in my videos. I can do other celebrities other than BTS as well. So let me know in the comments what you guys want to see. And I love you guys so much. Please give this video a thumbs up for me. It would help me out. And I'll talk to you next time. Bye!